I am walking through places that are dead, seeing silhouettes of love in my head, dressing in rags as my feet are tired, reflecting cell phones where brains are wired. Once I longed many women inside greed, lusting the flesh I wore by selfish need. All their phone numbers fade from wear and tear, biting back to buzz its sting from nowhere. My verbal magic did all the talking by clothed telephones sounding like squawking. I did speak of worship unpretentious by thrilled evening raw yet conscientious. Feminine phones linked faraway places tickling like strong lover embraces proposing morsel words with flamboyance. Now those specks of love are an annoyance. They all are crumbs that live in my backside, where shadows of rotary phones have died, dreaming dial-up phones grotesque and bare, where language encircled humps or hot air. They were expressions like a work of art, being the last numbers I knew by heart. Time is a greedy weasel, biting tails, Stepping into what famished love entails. Time is vicious circles of endless rides, Where passion and an avalanche collides. I disappear inside telephone names, Covering my soul in ringing war games. Bells are like the haunting wreck of a ship, Sleeping through lasting dreams that skinny dip. Lovers brought the meadow grass on my tide, leaving me speaking the waters untried. Their voices lay hunchbacked in telephones, vanishing in disconnected cyclones. Badgers slept behind those who served me well, as rotary was replaced by the sail. Moments are dialed like a chance event, as voices leave a man of discontent. All my best expressions were left unsaid, when telephone lovers were clothed and fed. All have passed inside other company, feeding their language, then making whoopee. Voices rest like bites without a kick start, being the last numbers I knew by heart. I looked up numbers until eyes were gone, as expressed telephone will was withdrawn. Shadows on the wall began to reveal all the other phantoms that seemed unreal. Silence can be like a choral thunder when a voiced love is another blunder. In a rotary phone was found a bond where a friendship or lover must respond. Rotary telephones fell in disgust to faded love blinded to all unjust. The telephone was hung between love thieves, where its foundation of youth, love, believes. Its silhouettes show lovers driving fast through bonded connections that did not last. Some love leaves greasy skid marks in backyards, sliding on surfaces with no regards. Voices cannot turn hands back on the clock or slide sideways in a man of Shell shock. The vocal organ sounds came to endear as the antique telephone holds me here. I know that my ear is not a spare part, judging the last numbers I knew by heart. Now one has found me where I was alone, silky and feminine like a cell phone. My voice now works past troubles I have had when believing no one has hurt this bad. Some cell phone angel must have heard my plea, sending another lover back to me, murmuring to keep my candles burning, where a saintly voice will be returning. Now I find no reason to reminisce of rotary phones and a secret kiss. My eyes that once I skated on those named, rest on the virtuous voice reclaimed. I trace twice the body that fascinates where no old lover voice assassinates. Her cell phone is shiny and feminine, captivating by a number herein 
Her voice is an orgasm in my ear, with her tickling words never unclear. She reminds me softly as she murmurs that fully developed love is firmer. I hope this union never comes apart, being the last number I know by heart.